Do you know what's not fun? Allergies. I've been suffering all day long. That's why I look like a mess today, okay? <laughs> Do you know what else isn't fun, for me at least? Reading action thriller books. Okay, so action thriller might not be the best way of describing these books, but I really don't know what to call them. I Google it and it says thriller and I'm like, it doesn't, these kind of books don't feel super thriller to me. They feel like detective thrillers, spy thrillers, stuff like that. Anything by like CJ Samson, Ian Rankin, those kind of books is what I'm talking about. But let me just preface this by saying, I don't think this book is poorly written. I think Abir Mukherjee is a pretty good author and I very much love the way he displays and talks about Kolkata. And this was his debut novel, it came out five or six years ago. I, he, I believe he's gone on to write at least three other novels and I think he has a fifth, a, a fifth novel, including this one, coming out in the foreseeable future, which is amazing. I wish Abir all of the success and I think this book, again, isn't poorly written. It's just not for me. I'll be honest, I truly do not like these kind of books. I do not like thriller, detective books. The only kind of detective mystery book I like is something like an Agatha Christie book or a, uh, who's the guy who wrote Sherlock Holmes? A Sherlock Holmes book. Oh God, I can't, I can't, Doyle. Doyle? But Doyle? <laughs> Comment down below who wrote Sherlock Holmes. But yeah, those are the kind of detective books I like. A little bit more about the discovery and the little grey cells. I think the time I had enjoying these detective spy action kind of books was when I was a teenager and I loved reading things like Alex Ryder or the Cherub series. That's because I was a teenage boy and it was these dudes with gadgets doing cool stuff and getting the girls and I'm kind of over that part. Listen, there are things about this book I genuinely liked. My favourite thing I think about this book was the main character and his relationship with the second main character, and particularly the main character's relationship with himself. I think the character of Sam was complex. I liked the layers. I'm not going to talk about spoilers as to why he's complex and his struggles. I like that. I like when authors give their characters, especially the main characters, personal demons to work through and work with. I love that and that's what I really enjoyed about this. However, I have always struggled reading these kind of books once I became an adult and once the more adult version of these books came into my life. Again, the Ian Rankins, the CJ Sampsons, those kind of stuff I struggle with and I really wanted to try this because obviously this is the Brown Booktuber channel where we are talking about books from all over Asia and other parts of the world. And so Abid Mukherjee being a man of South Asian descent, I really wanted to be this to be the action thriller or thriller book that first got me into the genre. Unfortunately it hasn't, and again it's no fault to the book itself, having read the entire book front to back. I can't fault it for being a bad book, a poorly written book. It's not that, and that's the thing that I find to be the only time I'll call a book bad, when it's poorly written or it's just straight up boring. It wasn't boring, it just, for me, it, it didn't grip me. Not because it wasn't boring, but just because I don't like the, just the style of this kind of book. It's very difficult to explain it because I don't think it's bad. I think if you like the likes of Ian Rankin and CJ Sampson, again, I'm using those two examples because they're on the front cover and also I actually have read their books. Or at least one of their books. If you like those kind of books, you will like this. And I'm sure this entire series, because uh, the characters in this book are now got a series about them from um, Mukherjee, which is amazing. Love it when an author is successful in getting a series written about their books. Love that so much. And if you like that, this this is for you. Again, it was another thing I had with the detective, the Inspector Chopra and Ganesh books. I liked the first one when I read it when I was 17, 18, maybe 19 years old. Loved it. Now I'm much older. Those aren't the books that really grasp me anymore. And I remember making a video about it and I really struggled with the third book, I believe it was. The, the Bollywood star one where he gets kidnapped. I believe that's the third book. 
very much struggled with it and it's unfortunate again uh, the highlights of this book for me i think are the main character and the secondary character are really really well written um i'm very happy that it is set in despite being set in 1919 beer has his main character not being the i can only describe them as colonial running dogs he is not one sam as a character is very wise to the fact of the effects of colonialism. He is scarred by the Great War. Again, a very deep, complex character, which helped me get through this book very much so. And again, I love it's set in Kolkata. It's very rich. Abir definitely has done his research. He's most likely been to Kolkata. I really should have looked this up. But <laughs> again, just really well presents India and is very much doesn't shy away from the bad parts about colonialism that and the main character and just the setting setting i think is the right word as well those three things i think to me were great it's just the style of novel isn't for me again this was a beard's debut novel so it was a good debut novel as well which is amazing i'm sure the other books are just as good if not better than this one having had you know more time to write having had more guidance from editors in the future or basing of how this book performed and the reviews amazing so if you like these thriller action thriller detective thriller i don't know how to describe these books type books pick this up i recommend it but if you're like me and you just don't like books like this maybe not but if you do the link to the book is going to be in the description down below for you to click and get this book i encourage you to get it if you do like it obviously and hey if you like these kind of books and you really really want me to have another crack at it give me a suggestion down below uh, again preferably by an author from asia or other parts of the world um but yeah that that's kind of my takeaway from this yeah i i i really i really really wanted this to be the one that broke me into the genre it's not but that's okay because everyone has their own personal preferences when it comes to reading books. And hey, if you have a preference for helping people, you can like and subscribe and share this video with a friend or family member you want to check out uh, this channel. And I hope you read a really, really great book today. Also, if it's sunny where you are, get some, get some of that sun. It's really sunny and really hot here. My allergies have been playing up.